It's maybe hard for some of us to imagine what it is like to live in a place where every time your child has a fever, you're worried that they have malaria and that that could potentially kill them. Malaria continues to be one of the biggest killers in Africa. So Noble has invested in the malaria sector for several years and actually here in Equatorial Guinea, there's been a massive campaign to provide bed nets and spraying on Bioko Island. And in addition, and even more importantly, they're testing new vaccines. So we are here to see the actual spraying by the teams and also we are here to see how we distribute the nets and how we hang them to ensure that uh, people at least use them. Normalmente la importancia de mi trabajo es eh, convencer a la gente, hacerles entender el problema del paludismo, así poder eh, aceptar las medidas de prevención que tenemos contra la enfermedad del paludismo with all their activities with bed nets, and spraying and doing tests and providing medication, they've been able to reduce the prevalence of malaria from about 45% of all children down to about 15% of all children. But the trouble is we can't eliminate malaria because people still have malaria parasites in their bloodstream. So the goal of the vaccine is to eliminate malaria from people's bloodstream prevent them from getting any infection at all. It's a legacy project to me. It's something that, uh, you know, goes far outside of what Noble is doing here. It goes even further than Equatorial Guinea. It's something that is world changing.